My next guest is a Georgia state senator who is calling for a special session to investigate Fulton County DA Fannie Willis. She will put Trump and 18 others on trial before the next election. Uh, we're joined now by Colton Moore. Senator, why are you calling to investigate DA Willis? Stuart, I, I woke up after the indictments and I felt like I had a hair in my biscuit. I said, this is disgusting. My goodness, we have a district attorney who is using taxpayer funds to make political prisoners. You see, my hardworking constituents, they pay taxes into the state of Georgia and money is going to fund this district attorney. Let us not forget, it took 19 days to certify the election results in Georgia. And Donald Trump and these 18 others, they were simply using their First Amendment right to question the integrity of the election. Some of these charges have nothing to do with nothing more than a tweet. It's absolutely ridiculous. That's why I'm calling this special session, because we have to take action now. Enough of the Facebook and the Twitter posts. But it's all about what, taking action. But what, you say take action. What action? Yeah. And what, what would well, you have you know, to show? What would you have to show that she's done that will be actionable? Well, first off, these are novel charges, right? You know, anybody that's went to law school, you, if you're going to be a prosecutor and you're going to make an indictment, you should be able to read the indictment while running and understand it. But this indictment is so off the walls. We're in uncharted territory with these types of charges. It's absolute nonsense, political persecution. But my job as a legislator is to put a check and balance on that. And we have the power of the purse. We have the power to investigate and oversight. So I'm all about, let's have this investigation. And when the corruption is shown, it's time to impeach her. Would that mean stopping the trial? There would be no trial if you're successful? Well, um, it, it's going to be a slow process, uh, it appears, uh, to get this special session because all of these Republicans are asleep at the wheel. But at the same token, it's it's waking Georgians up to the fact that their taxpayer money is going to fund this. Um, it's a uh, it's a it's a brewing momentum here in the state. Uh, people are frankly they're they're worried to speak out against her because it's Gestapo tactics that she's using. There's apparently going to be a second round of indictments. Um, this is complete tyranny here in Georgia today. Do you think he would get a fair trial if the trial proceeds? No, I don't think so. I mean, look at Fulton County. The ACLU is reporting that half of the inmates in that jail have yet to be charged with a crime. Then we've got rapper Young Thug, who's been in Von Dor jury selection now for a year. But yet she goes to the podium and says that, well, in six months, she's going to have these uh, in jail. I mean, think about all those attorneys that are going to be in that room all raising their hand to oh, make a motion at the same time. Yeah, that's not possible. That's a circus and it's impossible. Uh, Colton Moore, thank you very much for joining us this morning. We do appreciate it, sir. Thank you, Stuart. Yes, sir. Appreciate Thanks. it.